Welcome to the Car Guys channel. This is Tom. Uh, I'm doing my half of the video of our anniversary video here in beautiful Humboldt next to the Point River. That's uh, a little bit up right now. Thanks for all the lovely rainfall we've been having the last couple weeks. Um, we were supposed to do this together with Jeff, but uh, with gas prices the way they were, it wasn't feasible for me to haul all these out to out to um, to Cayman, Nebraska. So I'm gonna film my half here. Jeff's gonna film his half in uh, Tacoma, and we're gonna put them together and make one big video for you. Um, as you see, we got four cars here, and it is a very there are some very good examples. Um, we'll start right here with the. 98 320 ml uh, this is my mother-in-law's car i bought it for her what three months ago and she's been dri driving it ever since uh, a little rough around the edges uh, but you know it's got how many miles it's got on mom 224,000 it's got 224,000 miles on it and it still runs great. Um, it's, miss, it's missing a couple things. It's missing its fog lights. The, if you look over here, the wheels have a lot of corrosion on them. It's got a couple bumps. Why don't you, you point out all the flaws on this one? Go ahead. <laughs> so you got a bump right there? Got a, got a little dent right there. Uh, the interior is actually in really good shape on this car. The leather is in really good condition considering its age. It's still an all-wheel drive. Um, gets around great. And uh, it's just a little V6. Uh, it, it runs. One little I've driven it, it ran, drove great. Um, and you know, it's just a good little good little SUV for her. Um, the reason she got this is she had a like 17? 16. A 16? 16 Dodge Journey. And she played a uh, pinball with some deer. Uh, deer didn't like it too much and well, car lost. Um, but, you know, it's great. And, you know, down this one, you still got a little rust on it. But what do you expect? It's a 98. Uh, it's been driven pretty good. Yeah, it's got a few little quirks. Like the back hatch here. Um, you got to open it. You gotta push this down. Yep. It won't really, it won't spring back by its own, so you gotta push it down to get it to shut and latch. Uh, next off, we got my 07 S550 Formatic. I love this car. I mean, it's just been an awesome car. Um, had it for a year still haven't had to do much to it uh, I had to replace the front the front struts on it uh, and that was expensive and anybody knows about air shocks the, the, the shocks themselves are pricey but the interior is holding up well I've driven this car about 20,000 miles in the last year um, this car I like to take when I have to go to Omaha or when I have to drive to, up to Minnesota to see my mother-in-law um, or take my son up to uh, see his dad. Now this is the car we generally choose to take just because it does get great gas mileage. Even though it's got a big five liter V8, I'm still averaging about 25, 26 on the highway with it. And that's pretty good. Um, also, this winter, I had no problems whatsoever. You know, my wife's behind the camera right now, and uh, 
I don't know. Did you have any problems driving it in the winter? No. Oh, she ran pretty good. It, it takes snow like it's dry pavement. And it, it's it's really great handling car. Next up, we notice the car, you'll, you'll notice this car from our very first video. This is a 94 S500. Now, it's going to get its own video. This was in Jeff's fleet, but I own it now. Um, and I, I, I love this car. It is so comfortable to drive. Um, all the soft closed doors still work. My, 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 this guy right here, he loves the, uh, the reclining rear seat, don't you? <laughs> Andrew, do you like the reclining rear seat? Okay. <laughs> and, uh, you know, the hydraulic, uh, backup, uh, telescopes still work. Even though I, I find them pretty much useless because you cannot see them when you're backing up. Um, so maybe Mercedes could engineer that a little bit better. Uh, it runs great. It still has, it has a little bit of an oil leak. Actually, not an oil leak, a uh, hydraulic fluid leak out of the suspension. Um, This one's actually for sale right now because it's yeah you know, pretty close to being done. I mean, it's got a few flaws. The biggest flaw right here is on the trunk lid. The clear coat's kind of peeled off a little bit, and that's okay. Um, all the glass is in excellent condition. Uh, this doesn't work properly. Uh, it's just a gear it needs fixed. And, and it, it's just a great car. I love it to death. Um, wife's driven it a few times to go to work. It still gets, for a, five, for a five liter V8, it still gets, you know, around 25, 26 a gallon. Sometimes if I'm just cruising the highway, I can get it all the way up to 30. And that's pretty amazing for a car built in 1994. The uh, only bad thing about this car, if you do not run premium gas in it, it gets very, very temperamental. Next on the list, you'll remember from the previous video, my 2011 F-150. Uh, this is actually the wife's favorite vehicle. She loves to steal it, to drive to work and back or take the kids to school. Uh, apparently Andrew gets, gives it his seal of approval too. <laughs> <laughs> and, but this is the worst gas mileage vehicle we own. Um, but again, I did not buy it for its gas mileage. But right now, the way gas prices are, I told the wife it's gonna sit for a while. Uh, the interior, just been detailed on this one. So, it looks great on the inside, finally. <laughs> so, we get some better interior pictures of it. And I, I still haven't had to do a damn thing to this besides the oil change. Um, I'm eventually gonna need to replace my tires. They've been sitting in the garage for a few months now. I need to get around to actually putting them on. I think I'm gonna hold up, hold off on them until uh, October when it starts getting cooler off and burn the rest of these tires up. Um, but this is my, the conclusion of my half of the video. So from my half, from my half family to yours, be kind. Uh, and thank you for the wonderful support you guys have given for the last year. Um, don't forget to watch, like, and subscribe. And have a great day.